Hey guys, this is Scar Gaming here, and today I want to talk about gas mining and how profitable it can be. And like always, if you want to try playing EVE Online, I highly recommend using the referral code down below as it'll give you 1 million skill points that you can use to skill up into a venture. And I just want to caveat that I already did a lot of the scanning in this region, so you won't really see me running the scanning ship, you'll mostly see me running my venture as I am mining, or you'll probably see me running my hook bill uh, for when I meet some rats. And just a tip, because I didn't remember this uh, wormhole mechanic, but if you enter a wormhole multiple times within the same time span, you will get a cooldown timer, and that's what you saw, that little orange around the wormhole entrance. Uh, basically, it was telling me that I couldn't enter back within like two minutes, or I couldn't leave within two minutes of uh, re-entering. And I will say, it is just my luck to have rats instantly spawn, so here I'm warping out and I'm gonna grab my hook bill, probably. And I will say, I don't think the hook bill is really good for wormhole exploration. I probably need to find a better fit. So I wouldn't recommend running this particular hook bill in wormhole space. I, I'm 100% sure there's better, better curated fits that would work in wormholes as opposed to this one. But I had this particular ship lying around, and so I figured I'd use that instead of anything else. So here's where uh, the fun action begins of trying to clear the rats. And let me tell you guys, wormhole rats are no pushover. I had to warp, warp to safe uh, at some point because I was just taking too much damage. So yeah, like I mentioned, this fit definitely isn't the best, but uh, it gets the job done and it I managed to live. But I don't think that's because I'm good at the game. I think that's because I'm bad. So yeah, I think here I'm being neutered, but it's no big deal. I think I have to end up warping out again, actually, because I'm just taking an insurmountable amount of damage, yeah. But I think after I cleared the rats uh, here, I think this is the final push I make to clear all of them. And I get the job done. Like I said, the ship did its job, but it probably could have been easier. <laughs> So here is the final round where I take them all out um, and I just want to say if you see like a few bits of jumps around here it's because when I was recording the the video for some reason there was some very high pitched spikes so I, I had to delete those so if you see a little bit of skipping and jumping uh, I apologize for that I don't really know what happened there.
But yeah, just to reiterate, this fit is bad, guys. I do like negative damage, and it feels like I take an absurd amount of damage, but um, it works. It works. I'll, I'll link this fit in the description, too, if you want to try using this, but this is by all means not a, a recommended fit um, to really take out any wormhole rats. I highly recommend looking over the ranges on your fit because even though the hookbill is a missile um, ship and missiles do tend to have very far distances, it is quite difficult, as you can see here, to kind of evade them or keep distance on them. I tried keeping distance of somewhere along the lines 10 to 20 kilometers, but it still seemed like they could reach me. So definitely double check before you go into any wormhole whether your ship can actually handle some of this. Here you sort of see me try and check to see what the defenses are because it really felt like I was doing negative damage sometimes. So I wanted to triple check. It just seems like they're an all-rounder ship that can kind of tank a lot. So I guess in a sense I'm lucky that they do very little DPS. But at the same time I think I was also doing very little DPS so I guess it worked out. And I don't want to admit this, but it definitely took me longer than what I was anticipating to kill these NPCs. So, yeah, I mean, do what you will with that information uh, and learn from my mistakes here, uh, as I always kind of preach. Another benefit that I saw from killing the NPCs was they drop really high tier loot for some reason. That neural network you see there ends up being 200 isk per item. And I think there was about five, so each one drops to you. If I could do math, that's 10. If you multiply it by 200, it's about 2 million isk or so. Mind you, I didn't pick all of them up because I had very slow ships and I was very lazy, but you probably want to pick them all up if you're in there yourself. Also, I don't exactly know why the NPCs were already there by the time I got there. Uh, I was under the impression that uh, you would have to land on the mining site and then it would take 15 minutes for rat NPCs to show up, but I guess someone must have triggered it and potentially died. I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, by the time I got there, the rats were there, but I don't think that usually happens, but someone can correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. And just some foreshadowing, I end up losing my ship after this first haul or after the second haul i end up not taking a probe scanner with my venture so i'm gonna drop a fit in the description of a venture that actually i think would i would recommend going forward and it's going to be the fit i use going forward but yeah my my wormhole exit ended up expiring which i forgot was a thing and so uh, when i tried to go warp back to my exit there was no more wormhole 
entrance or exit, and I was unable to really do anything. And just a reminder guys, if you do like this content, I highly recommend leaving a like and potentially leaving a comment if you are interested in watching some more of my videos of this kind. Uh, it really helps the channel grow and please consider subscribing if you like the content as well. And here, I pretty much come back to the final portion. I'm just going to skip to the very end where I am full of cargo and kind of just showcase like the earnings that I made from this run. And here, I'm just trying to pick up the remnants of the ships that were destroyed to try and loot that. And then I will skip to the final, final portion. All right, so here we are. I think we got about, um, and I'm gonna do the calculations here from all the ships, but I think we ended up netting over 24 million isk. So this wraps this video up for today. I hope you all enjoyed and I hope to see you all in the next one.